The Navy's revolutionary electromagnetic railgun will be displayed for the first time in the eastern U.S. early next month at the Future Force Expo in Washington, D.C. Chief of Naval Operations Admiral Jonathan Greenett will speak at the event. The railgun substitutes electromagnetic propulsion for gunpowder, launching projectiles at six times the speed of sound over distances of more than 100 nautical miles. The gun reduces the need for ships to carry high explosives and also reduces the danger of unexploded ordnance remaining on the battlefield. Navy officials hope to begin testing the railgun at sea in 2016. Fire. Electromagnetic railgun is a gun that uses just electricity, no gunpowder, and oh, by the way, can shoot a projectile like this well over 100 miles at Mach 7. Rear Admiral Fuller added that the EM railgun technology represents a new offensive capability for the U.S. Navy, allowing them to counter a wide range of threats at relatively low. to carry high explosives and also reduces the danger of unexploded ordnance remaining on the battlefield. Navy officials hope to begin testing the railgun at sea in 2016. Electromagnetic railgun is a gun that uses just electricity, no gunpowder, and oh, by the way, can shoot a projectile like this well over 100 miles at Mach 7. Rear Admiral Fuller added that the EM railgun technology represents a new offensive capability for the U.S. Navy, allowing them to counter a wide range of threats at relatively low. The Navy's revolutionary electromagnetic railgun will be displayed for the first time in the eastern U.S. early next month at the Future Force Expo in Washington, D.C. Chief of Naval Operations Admiral Jonathan Greenett will speak at the event. The railgun substitutes electromagnetic propulsion for gunpowder, launching projectiles at six times the speed of sound over distances of more than 100 nautical miles. 
The gun reduces the need for...